Some San Diego employees say that they've been treated like animals at a local hotel. Now, they work for the Marriott La Jolla. They are now speaking out. Team 10 reporter Natasha Zuvez went undercover at the Marriott, and she explains why the company that runs that hotel says workers are making the whole thing up. Walking into the Marriott La Jolla, it seems like any other hotel. But many workers here say for the past 14 months, it's been a nightmare. The doctor told me I have really high infection in my kidneys because I can use the, re the restroom when I need to. Nellie Waitley was hospitalized for two days. She's been working in Marriott La Jolla's restaurant for 13 years, and she says ever since HEI took over, she'll go for hours without a bathroom break. It makes money by saving money on labor. So they cut staffing, uh, in effect forcing workers to do two or three jobs. It's a hotel-wide issue. A hotel-wide issue, according to union organizers, that's hitting housekeepers hard. We accessed the hallways open to any member of the public, and we saw a pretty standard scene. But it was the pace that was shocking. They don't care about us. They just care about money. Luz Olivera says she suffers from chronic knee pain. She used to check 25 rooms a day. Now the number is closer to 100. The single biggest problem in housekeeping is the repetitive motion. The bending, the stooping, the lifting. Another health risk many don't realize, these housekeeping carts. Each one weighs 50 to 60 pounds. 10 News investigated and we found at least six other locations of alleged inhumane conditions under HEI, including the Hiltons in Mission Valley and in Long Beach. HEI told 10 News in a statement that the workers at the La Jolla Marriott are exaggerating. They blame the union for generating, quote, rumors, complaints, and negative publicity and say they have an open door policy. <laughs> well, we obtained video of that open door policy. After weeks of not being heard, employees stormed the office of the general manager weeks ago. It ended abruptly. <laughs> Ironically, with new health risks emerging for many workers, HEI also raised health insurance. Nellie and Lou say full-time they only bring home $980 a month. HEI's family plan is almost $500 a month. Both are now uninsured. I have a kid and um I can take to the doctor when they get sick. Nellie says she's scared of losing her job after speaking to us, but she'll keep fighting for her daughter to teach her a lesson. We are humans, not animals. Natasha Zuves, 10 News. Workers at the La Jolla Marriott and the Mission Valley Hilton, which is also owned by HEI, are hoping to unionize so they can ask for their rights without the risk of being fired. It is a real risk. They say earlier this year, five housekeepers were fired at Hilton Long Beach after complaining about unfair working conditions. We asked HEI about this. They said their employees shouldn't fear retribution for speaking out.